Alrighty, righty Let's talk about Favre. Let's talk about the fucking thief who has over $10 million damn dollars, but somehow it wasn't enough for him. So, yeah, let's talk Brett Favre. Let's talk the rambling, bumbling thief. Let's talk a mad man who has a <clears throat> history, yet somehow manages to get the fuck away with all this shit. Y'all help me out. Brett Favre. Yeah, I'm talking Brett Favre. Why is this man not in jail? Y'all help me out. I want your advice. I want your views of this. Help me out, people. Brett Favre. I want to talk about it. Hello, hello, hello. How you doing, sweetie? I want to talk Brett Favre. I want to Let me bring up Miss T. What's up, T? Hey, honey, I'm sorry. I just wanted your opinion. T, I can barely hear you. Hold on a second. What? I'm, I'm in my hotel room rocking out with my chicken out. Um, oh, Lord, me, Lord, me, Lord, Lord. Let me grab one of, my ear, one of my earbuds. But I can barely hear you, T. Maybe down a little bit. How about that? Is that better? Better. Uh, better. Oh wait, it was my volume. Yes, you're much fine now. You're much better now. <laughs> sorry. God damn it. Right. I'm sorry. All right, that's okay. Brett Favre. Can Come we on. please? Come on. Up. For you not to have your ass in jail right now, five to six million dollars, and that Republican governor, who's a man, I don't know why there was such problem with water. Uh, dude, you gave Bullshit. the fucking money away. He look. Here's here's my thoughts on this whole thing. Okay, <clears throat> because the first thing that happened. <clears throat> something like $70 million came up missing, right? Yeah. So the Secretary of State hired an attorney to go and start finding this money, like a special master, Yep. as they're apparently known in these days. Yeah. Um, so this attorney started discovering things, and he discovered that the former governor of Mississippi... Uh, spent welfare money getting a volleyball court built uh, because his daughter played volleyball. Now, I did not know Jackson, Mississippi was known for its volleyball prowess. That that never came up in any anything that I've ever read. Yep. Um, and I I thought I just recently found out earlier today. I was under the impression that Brett Favre 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 Brett Favre I was under the impression that he had only gotten like 700 or 800 thousand dollars okay because that they the special master who was looking into this the current governor fired him okay and what they had discovered is that between Brett Favor, Favor being, yeah. between him, the volleyball stadium, and a WWE wrestler, $70 million came up missing. Yeah. Right? Yeah, not 100. Right. <laughs> and I'm sorry. Uh, oh, man, who is the football player? A black gentleman. Um, he was on the ESPN a couple of days ago, and he's like, "Look, I knew what a piece of crap Brett Favre was, right?" Wait, and he called him, he called him point out. How do you make a hundred million dollars in the NFL, and now you can't you 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 gonna sit here and take money from one of the poorest states in the country because yep. they want you to do a speaking engagement 
And then you don't even show up for the speaking engagement. And now you mad because they want their money back? Thank you. Shannon Sharp. Shannon Shan- Sharp. Yes, that's him. Yes. Love Shannon. Thank you. Yes. He Shannon was... Everybody in the NFL knew how dirty he was, yep. how nasty he was, how he, he mistreated people. The very least he could have fucking done would have been to go around to other football players and say, hey, I'm going to hold a fundraiser. I'd appreciate if you guys would come. My daughter's school wants to build this. No, instead you stole money from welfare. Yeah. Hey, yo, I have not been able to find the name of the wrestler. I don't know who the wrestler is yet. Um, But look, the fact that the former governor had been given infrastructure money, the fact that the current governor had been given infrastructure money, you gave 70 million fucking dollars. And both of them are Republicans, mind you. You gave 70 million dollars for a a freaking volleyball stadium and uh, a WWE wrestler and Brett Favre. You gave all this money away to them. But your own citizens don't have fucking water. Are you kidding me with this bullshit? I, I just couldn't believe when I was reading that article for the first time, a lot of people believe that they were reading that article uh, or when they heard about it, they believe that Brett got 70 million, but he did not get 70 million. He got like, I, I through earlier research or research that I did earlier today um, while I was waiting on the water to heat up in the shower here in my hotel room, <laughs> the uh, he got like, because I was under the impression he got like seven hundred or eight hundred thousand dollars, when in fact he got like six or seven million dollars. Yep, yep, yeah. It's like, hold on, these are Republic. This is a Republican governor, and Brett Favre, who admits his ass is Republican, you stole money that could have gone to benefit people. What the hell? They, they stole, and this was money that is missing straight from the welfare program. That is direct benefit to the people. Exactly. Tracy, it it's it's in the, the article. It's, Tracy, it's a total of 70 million in money that was squandered. And Jason, I have no idea what you're talking about. Ukraine has all the water. That that just doesn't even make any sense to me. We 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 got we got <coughs> no time to play with that. No time yeah, at all. Darren is saying, a, let me in. I'll tell you more about Brett. Well, I mean, I, uh, we're on a dual live. I, I'm not in a guest box, and T's not in a yeah, guest so box. We're we on a dual live. Me right now. I'm right. sorry. <laughs> and Teddy, I don't know how Mississippi's water is. At my last read, which was yesterday uh, at about 4 o'clock, about 85 to 90% of the water pressure has been restored, but now they have to start making sure the water gets filtered. Okay. Yeah. And that was a brief reading that I did on my part, so don't quote me on that. Hi, Aaron. But it's the army. I'm, but the army, uh, army corps of army engineers. Oh look, lord! Look at, look at me and my homie Wolf Blitzer. <laughs> we just chilling right now. You know, look oh, there, there, there's Wolf. I don't know who that guy is. Get Wolf back on the screen. Oh no, this is split screen. <laughs> But I'm sorry, the Army Corps of Engineers went in and fixed and worked on this shit. Mm-hmm. But, they, but T, here's the thing. They've been warned for years that these water pumps were going to fail. They've been yep. warned for years. It's just like right before Katrina hit. They found out that the investigators on the uh, levees, investigators had, and inspectors had told them for years these things are going to fail if the water gets up too high. Yeah. Nobody listened. They didn't put any money. It's like, eh, we'll deal with it when it comes, you know, because the qualified inspector, <laughs> they don't know what they're talking about. Uh, yeah. But the, but the politician with no experience knows exactly what they're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. That amazing. Exactly, Jeff. But seriously, I was looking at this going, why is this man not in jail? And apparently this shit kind of started 
back doing um, oh, 2019. Oh, breaking news, breaking news. Bexar County, Texas Sheriff investigating migrant flight to Martha's Vineyard. Go for it. Dude, Go dude, for it. wait a minute. I got to bring this up right quick. We're going to jump from far over Go to... Ahead. Um, uh, Wait, how, damn, how do you say it? How do you, T, how do you say his name? Who? The, Brett, how do you say his last name? The Satan? No, Brett, Brett. How do you say Brett Brett's last Favre. name? Brett Favre. 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 Now, <laughs> now, I'm in North Carolina. Okay, I'm going to throw this mm -hmm. out there right quick. So we have quite a few people from um, South America. So they, the ladies usually sit together and have lunch together. And they started talking about DeSantis. Mm -hmm. And and they said, did you see what happened last week? And then the ladies switched to Spanish. But I could clearly hear her saying, DeSantis, asshole, DeSantis. <laughs> DeSantis. And finally, I just turned around and said, excuse me, I don't mean to dip in, but y'all talking about DeSantis from Florida? They looked at each other. Switch back to switch back to English, and finally I said, "Wait a minute." So, where are you and your family from? We had two That's awesome. One person from Chile, one person from Colombia, and one person from Nicaragua. Uh huh. And they said, "Wow, we all have families still down in South America." What That's he pretty did, diverse too. Disgusting. Yeah, he said yeah. it was disgusting. So Sir, Sir Mateo asks, when are they going to investigate Biden's flights to New York, leaving them in random parking lots? Uh, Sir Mateo, that shit never happened. Because the Biden flights, everybody was informed they were coming. They knew exactly what time they were landing. And there were people standing by there to greet them and help them. So please yeah. try something else. Yeah, sorry. You don't get to make what excuses up, for people who are assholes. No, I don't, Mateo, I don't need to check again. Please don't tell me to check again. Please don't tell me to check again. Y'all kill me with that shit. Do your research. Look it up. I do more fucking research in a day than you have done in your whole goddamn life. There hey, you Katie. Go. Hi, Suzanne. There you go. I do more research in a day. I'm not checking anything again. I already know. Um there is literally nothing wrong with them sending anywhere if they actually planned and spoke to the goddamn governor, who, by the way, is Republican. Yeah. Who, by the way, is the one that said, all right, we're going to get everything in order. A Republican couldn't talk to a Republican? Yep, I do my research on Hunter's laptop. In fact, let me show you where my setup is. I've been doing this research, and look, don't y'all tell nobody where I'm at. Uh-oh, okay? uh-oh. But I've been I've been doing my research on Hunter's laptop on my setup right there. <laughs> That's the laptop. That's Hunter's laptop. I've been in a hotel room for the past year and a half doing all this research, making sure I bring it out to you all because we need to know the truth, people. Somebody we got said to have, um, we got to have the somebody, truth. We ain't got the truth. What do we Baker. got? Someone said Governor Baker is a rhino. Because he did his fucking job. Then what do you call a Republican that doesn't do their job? They they kill me with that rhino shit, man. It it just it it shows you how deep in the cult they are. Anytime somebody doesn't agree with them, now all of a sudden they're a rhino. Oh my god, you're a rhino. Have have we ever called anybody on the Democratic side dinos? No. What do you mean he's one of the most beloved governors? Hey Shay. Uh, Excuse me, don't you think people in their own state love their own governor? Why are hey, you projecting hey. whiskey, Trank Tango, Fox Trot? Why are you projecting your love and your obsession onto anybody else? So I, I think we need to get a panel going. Okay, and I got about an hour because my boss is on his way to Alabama right now. He'll be here in about an hour. But I think we need to get a panel going. Um, so... T, drop, drop down and then come back into my live, send a guest request. I'd like to bring up Shay and Brian so we can all talk about this whole thing because Shay is actually in Texas and she's oh. going to have a little bit of insight as to what's going on with the, uh, with the whole thing um, in terms of immigrants being moved and this and the other thing. Plus, Shay is also yeah. a historian. Um, Brian, 
Brian just got all kinds of good input. And and T, you know I love you, girl. I just I just want you there for effect. <laughs> but like, what is wrong with y'all? What is wrong with y'all? I I swear. All right, I'm out. Uh, I was just having a quick conversation about Brett Favre. Why is this man not being held fucking accountable? That that's Why what I can't figure out. The fact that this is already in the courts and they're having to sue him over a contractual obligation that he did not fulfill. I I just I I can't even entertain that. You mean to tell me I paid around. you money to do something and you didn't do, and now you're mad because I want the money back? T, <laughs> that would be like that would be like you going to buy a car, and then all of a sudden I'm saying you saying. Well, look, I put $10,000 down on this car. Well, we don't have the car. We'll give him back my $10,000. No, no, we'll get the car eventually. No, 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 that ain't how this shit works. I want my money back. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, a thief, a liar, a con man. But you love Brett. You love yep. him, baby. That's you. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Bye-bye. I just popped on right. for a minute. Yeah, see you, T. T, you know you're always welcome, girl. Anytime. Oh, thank you, thank you. All right, bye-bye. Right, see you, T. Let me disconnect the rules. Biden covers up huge influx of illegal migrants. Oh, Mateo, you poor disillusioned soul. I mean, come oh, on. Oh, Lord, Lord, Lord. Okay, disconnect. There. <laughs> Woo, boy. Oh, boy. It is amazing covering for this old rich guy who didn't have the cojones to at least go to other football players and say, look, I'm going to do a fundraiser. Instead, he stole money from poor people. He undercut the support of those without when he's already a millionaire. Damn, the grift is strong. Y'all have a great day. I am out. Moderators, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Just wanted to bring up and have a little conversation about Brett Favre. Lord have mercy. Uh, I'm talking about Brett Favre, honey. I think you're in the wrong live, some. Okay? You're reaching a bit. Uh, uh. Sounds like a Democrat. Sorry, but he's a Republican. Yeah, and so's the governor that worked with him. A Republican whiskey, whiskey fox, fox trot. Well, they already got him. Yeah, it's going through the courts. So it's not what I got. It's what the state has, okay? Y'all have a good day. Night, guys. Remember, trust the tea, not the Kool-Aid. <laughs>